The clausius statement of the second law of thermodynamics says, heat flows spontaneously from a hot object to a cold one, but not the reverse. This statement tells us that there are no free refrigerators. Heat does not flow out of the colder refrigerator into the warmer kitchen by itself. We have to make it happen by doing work. In order to make the inside of the refrigerator cooler, we have to pull heat out of the refrigerator and dump it into the warmer kitchen. We have to put in work to make this happen. This part is the mechanism of the refrigerator. We put in mechanical work to pull this heat from low temperature region so we can dump all that into the high temperature region. We pull some heat out of the low temperature region and we dump more heat into the high temperature region because the heat we dump into the high temperature region includes both the QL and W. QH equals to QL plus W. If you compare a refrigerator to a heat engine, you can see everything looks the same except for the arrows are in opposite directions. So it's like the reverse of the heat engine. When the refrigerator turns on, the motor drives the compressor to compress the refrigerant inside into high pressure vapor. When the refrigerant is compressed, the work done on the gas is positive heating up the gas so it becomes hotter than the kitchen so it can give off heat QH to the kitchen. After giving off the heat, the refrigerant condenses, the expansion valve then opens, the refrigerant expands and cools down. Now the refrigerant is cooler than the inside of the refrigerator so it absorbs heat QL from the inside of the fridge. The refrigerant then returns to the compressor and the cycle starts again. In the refrigerator cycles, both the QL and the work W get dumped into the kitchen as QH, the heat. So the more you keep the compressor of your refrigerator running, the more it heats up your kitchen. So on a hot day, you may not wish to stand in front of your refrigerator with its door open to cool off because it will only cause your kitchen to get hotter. An air conditioner works the same way as a refrigerator. We have to use a compressor to do work in order to pull heat out of a cooler house into the warmer outdoors. Similarly, in the winter time, a heat pump does work to pull heat from the cooler outdoors and dump the QH into the warmer house. This means that if you compare a 1000 watt electric heater you plug into the wall outlet to a 1000 watt heat pump, the electric heater can only supply a thousand joules of heat per second. However, a heat pump can supply the extra QL in addition to the 1000 joules of work per second. 